Hey guys, you're watching Boondocking with Dennis. My buddy Paul told me that the boat ramp over here was a good spot to get a view of the lake. We just passed a little golf course clubhouse. That looks like it's part of the golf course. The lake's over there. But how do us poor people get over there? <laughs> Got some barbed wire, the devil's rope. I just saw there was a beer coming out October 11th in Texas, 28% alcohol, $240 a bottle. And I don't know what size that bottle is. <laughs> There's the lake. I think that's Lake Pat Cleburne. That's pretty. Some bugs jumped on the windshield on the way over here. And this might be a good spot to catch a sunset, huh? At least it's open. Pretty good breeze coming off the water. It's just blowing hot air, but I bet you in two days it's going to be nice and cool. Some people fishing. I wonder how far down this road goes. This is nice. You guys want to see some water? kind of pretty just kind of drive around and check out this little park area if you will if it is a park it's a nice lake there's the clubhouse up there on the hill for the golf course and it is 101 out right now and that smudge you see there is a bug that was having an unhappy life couldn't take the pressure anymore sad to say he jumped right on my windshield well there's the boat ramp so this must be the spot And this is the uh, east end. This is the east boat ramp, and there's a west boat ramp. I don't know what direction that would be in, though. Hmm. Ain't that pretty? Ain't it pretty? What do we got up here? Some extra life preservers? City of Cleburne, Lake Pat Cleburne at Kirtley Park. Hours 7 a.m. to midnight, no overnight camping. Swimming in designated areas only, no lifeguard on duty. Loner life jackets. That's neat. The child should always wear a U.S. Coast Guard approved life jacket in or near the water. But you should also make sure your child can swim before he gets near this body of water unsupervised. That's pretty neat. Well, I gotta back up a little bit, guys. I'm just moonwalking now. This guy's got a nice Spiffy boat trailer. There's the clubhouse up on the hill there. That's pretty. I 
it's a pretty day. It's too bad it's 101 degrees. <laughs> it was actually a little warm sleeping last night. Not like Rockport hot, but I had a few cool nights up in here and then the last couple have been warm. Nothing too bad though. And I think we got another warm one tonight. And then we're gonna get cool weather and I'm gonna be happy. And I got a list of stuff to do to work on the truck. And I haven't done it for the last few days because I've been running around filming and it has been hot during the day. So I'm gonna pause since we already saw this part and then I'll start again when we get up the other end. This is about where we started, where we came in. It's a very nice park. Wonder why they have those bullards there. Wonder if this was ever a, like a city park and they were dividing up the lots with those, you know? I'm not sure. That other park that I have been uh, seeking shade at when I do return to town and doing all my editing has a lot of shade. This one doesn't seem to offer too much shade but it is very nice. Let me show you this house up here. I don't have the external mic in. There's a fixer upper guys. I think I'm gonna uh, do some clickbait. title this one should I buy this house <laughs> I need catchier clickbait titles that's how you get the views from your regular viewers will hate you but you'll get a lot of people clicking once man these houses are you got some big old good ones up here Big old good ones and good old big ones. They can pay all the money they want, but if they have to see the water, they gotta look at me at first today. <laughs> Here's a little hill. I guess my big complaint about this area is I have not seen anyone in a bikini since I got here. Even up at Granberry Lake, I guess I didn't go down to the sandy part, but how am I gonna yell for people to put clothes on if they already got clothes on? It's a dilemma. I still got a few little towns to check out. I still wanna check out um, couple little towns around here uh, check out uh, Cleburne so what is that it's like a little dam there damn I'm gonna go down there next look at that yeah that's a spillway right there you can see it where it drops off or it looks like it what do I know don't listen to me kids can we drive across that can we throw rocks from up there <laughs> Probably getting some wind. Sorry about that. Let's, uh, let's drive over to that damn dam. Take a look around. This is pretty, huh? I can get used to this. It's a nice park. Nice free park. Lots of nice parks in Cleburne, actually. Well, I don't know what I was looking at, but disappointed. There ain't no damn damn here. 
Damn. Water treatment, maybe? Secret government uh, facilitates? Top of a big German hand grenade? I'm not sure what's going on around here. <laughs> I can see the lake way over there. Oh, it cuts this way. Okay. I don't know what it is. Looks like treatment right there. Well, I just wanted to pull over for a second. It is officially 100 degrees. The heat index is 102. In Rockport, Texas, it's officially 90 degrees. 10 degrees less than here right now but the heat index is 106 girl in a bikini right there on the left excuse me miss put some clothes on uh, she's got on shorts and a shirt damn nope she had on a bathing suit better get back there and harass her also her boyfriend had on swimming trunks too let me make a u-turn up here and go tell them to put some clothes on Hey, thanks for riding along today, guys. I appreciate y'all. Don't forget to check out the description. I got a lot of my friends' videos there. Links to uh, their channels, Tracy and Leah and uh, Rusty and Adventuring Art. Got a bunch of them there. Check them out. And uh, I appreciate y'all. Thanks for watching.